All right, today I'm gonna be going over extensions for your GNOME shell. And the GNOME shell version I'm using is 3.0.1. And uh, I got this at uh, gnome.org. There's two versions. There's a Fedora, I think that's the beta. And there's this one, the OpenSUSE version. So I downloaded this one. It's about a DVD size. It's a little, I don't know if it's under or over a gig, but you need a DVD to, in order to use it. But anyways, um, that's where I got it. And these are the extensions. So these extensions will add a couple bits more of a, you know, I don't know what to call it exactly. They're like just little bits and pieces of code that you add to your to your uh, to your shell, and it'll add a you know some functionality to it. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So here's a little uh, link right here. So I'm just going to download this. Press save. Okay, my downloads. Save it. Let me go there right now downloads and here it is so right click and extract it and huh, what, it's kind of funny you won't see it but it's right here and you have to hold control in H it's actually a dot folder so in case you extract it and you don't see it hold control press H and you'll see this little hidden folder anyways what I guess what they want you to do is actually copy this to here your home folder here you know probably override um, your dot local folder but instead of doing that, I'd rather just, you know, just go in there and grab the files I need. Extensions. Here they are. So I'm going to highlight all this. Copy it. Go to my home folder here. And uh, look for .local. Share. Gnome Shell. Extensions. Right click and paste. Now they're they're in there but they're not working yet so you have to reload shell so to do that hold alt press f2 type r hit enter and now your extensions are working and basically what i installed are if you notice with gnome shell you have these little you know app pins these little you know you just drag an app into here and you pin it to quick to quickly launch it so pretty much whatever you have in here will be will be pinned up on top. So you won't have to be swiping your mouse to the top left to get to it. You can just click up here if you want. Also, this little drop down menu, which I like a lot. This 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 is very useful for me. And uh, <laughs> the the uh, clock, it's moved to the far right way over here. So I really like that. So other than uh other than that, that's really it. I mean, there's some other extensions out there, but they don't seem to work for me yet. And, um, you know, I, I really like what they're doing. So this is like a good step forward as far as, you know, personalizing your desktop, you know, modifying it to your needs. So uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'm, if, if any more of these extensions come out, I'm going to be, you know, experimenting with them, see how they work and see how good they are. And, you know, from there, I'll just make another video, of course. But um, anyways, uh, thanks for watching.